gonna start every Brother video with a blast from the past. So here it is. Get married. <laughs> no. Bro. What? So we totally snuck on test track. What I say? We snuck out. We bad butt. We bad in the bone. Like a boss. Get married. Por favor, manténganse ya la... Well, since you motivated me, I say it's time to get started. Let's get this brother video on the roll. So, as I thought of a response to your first video of let's get started, I started thinking about my journey. This past weekend, I had a cool opportunity to go and get my district license interview, which in the past has always been just walk in, interview with 15 people, they fire questions at you and you hope you got the right answers help you remember the right thing from school, um, in your studies, in your experience in ministry, and uh, it's not always pleasant. So thankfully, the Georgia District has changed things up and we did it in a small group setting where we just spent uh, Friday and Saturday together just eating, hanging out, and uh, it was really a neat experience. Through this process, I've just kept flashing back to my dad and how um, I took my dad so long to get through this process and I kept changing classes on him and he couldn't do a bunch of classes at once because he was busy and had a family and it just was a mess. And uh, I always wondered how he didn't get frustrated at it. And then I began to realize my goal in moving to Georgia, I thought, you know, well, I'll move down there and get ordained as quick as I can, and <clears throat> you know that'll give me full reign to do whatever role of ministry, and you know it looks better in finding jobs when you're ordained already, and, and people look for that and appreciate that. And <sighs> I think my perspective has changed. You know, so often, like you have talked about, we we we're looking for the end result, we're looking for the goal. And we think once we get there, things will get better. Uh, but I think I've, I've realized that the journey is the journey is the best part. The process matters and is enjoyable. And when we're working towards our goals, sometimes we think the goal and getting there will be the best part. But as we're being shaped and formed on our way to our goals, quite an adventure and it's pretty fun and it's cool to look back on how the process has already developed you uh, and this applies for everything in life um, any situation that you're looking for the end if we're not too careful we'll just find ourselves always chasing the next goal uh, and we'll never celebrate we'll never feel accomplished and we'll find this just this sense of void. But, brother, I'm here to say the journey, the journey's a okay. The journey is where we learn, the journey's where we grow. So I hope I'm never not on the journey, because then I'll stop learning and growing, and then I might as well die. We're here to learn and grow and, and continue, so. We're journeying in different ways right now, but this journey is still enjoyable. So through my interview process, um, things went well. Um, absolutely fine, and I'm, I'm still on track. Um, although I was hoping that somehow I'd get ordained this year, I realized the journey still continues, and I can still enjoy every day, every step of the way, and when I get ordained when I get to that goal um, I'll still be on a journey of, of my call still be on a journey of, of life as you know 
someone in their 20s in the year 2019. This crazy world we live in. Living the dream. Staying focused on your goals. But enjoying the process in the meantime. And when we learn to enjoy the journey, I think we can find ourselves sitting in a bathtub, fully clothed, wearing sunglasses inside at night. Because the journey's fun. And our goals, we'll get there. Crispus Atticus was afraid to late. Is butter a carb? What time is it?